Do I have a story to tell? A guaranteed fish. And I guarantee a nice dinner with smoked ham steak, potatoes, sugar snap peas, onions. I've got a surprise for a dessert. A little nice liquor. I've been going back to these ponds. This is the St. Regis Wilderness Canoe Area near Saranac Lake, Lake Placid. I've been going to these ponds since 1976. You know I'm like the palm of my hand. Which palm, I don't know, but we'll, we'll make it do. Let's go, Kelly. Years ago, as a young buck, I came out here with my parents. And about 10 years old, my mother was in the canoe. And big old thunderstorm wind, my father got lost. Mama was not a happy canoeist. <laughs> I can still remember the tears in her eye. Ew! Forty pound pack. What was that? This is a new campsite for you, Lair. Brand new. Been staying on this lake for a couple decades, but never made it back to this site. It's hard to find a site today because many of them are closed due to overuse. So we've only seen three open campsites, and we just filled the third ones. But it's nice. I'll take it. And it's a nice one at that. And this is for Chris. Here's your hammock that you gave me for Christmas. I think two years ago, and I haven't used it other than the back porch. Tonight will be my first being a hanger camper. in a hurry. We were just talking to some guys. They were camping here and they said there was a bear that came into their campground. They are on the other side of the lake though. We have all our food with us. We didn't leave any at the campsite. Which is a good thing I think. Uh, next prudent thing to do is make sure you bring the bear spray next time. Wrong pond? Wrong. Incorrect. Nada. That's on tape, by the way. <laughs> okay? You're being recorded. Okay, I effed up again. I, I told Larry just a few minutes ago that I, I enjoy camping with him because we both do these kinds of things and we totally appreciate each other despite the fact that we do these things. To you, Nolan. <laughs> well, I couldn't find the worms. Up your nose with a rubber hose, <laughs> Horshack used to say. I think it's straight ahead. I still hope so. Some fishing in today. When was the last time you were here? Really? Ten years? I 
think I'm getting them. I hope I am. Between that is only in the spelling. That's what I've heard. The trail used to go right across there. We're gonna scoot over a little beaver pond. There's our trail sign. <laughs> Got about a uh, 50 yard paddle through the <laughs> through the uh, mangrove swamp here. Yeah. Off of that elusive brook trout. So why is Fontanellus trout of the springs? Latin there. We're gonna catch dinner here today. Dinner, possibly breakfast. Ooh, breakfast. Now explain whose fish that is oh, first. No, I, it's not my fish. But I, but I told you where to catch them. I told he, you you took me right to the spot. And I bought the worms. <laughs> Woo! We're on, uh, That's awesome. We're on an Adirondack pond. I won't tell you where, but he's all of uh, 15, maybe 16 inches, pound and a half. I, I don't know if it's a male or female, but that's a nice fish. And <clears throat> Kelly was right out in the middle of the pond just casting, and he... Followed it up to the boat and didn't hit. He cast again and bang. So, all right. Surfing turf tonight, boy. Make up. I'm just not getting a good look at him yet, but he's, I'm really playing him out. And this Kelly is called a net. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you bring them in with. Yeah, he's, a, he's not like yours, but he's decent. He's, he's about 12 inches. Feisty. Come on, sweetheart. That's it. Put on a show for the camera. There we go. My first trout of the trip. Of, uh, to come. We hope. We're going to have too much fish to eat. <laughs> That's too bad, huh?
Okay, time for the uh, enjoyable task of cleaning the fish. The, uh, the little one is in Kelly's hands. That's mine, maybe, maybe 10 inches. Kelly's is, uh, that's the 10 incher there. Uh, Kelly's is an honest 15, if I lie at 16, but uh, decent fish. Caught on garden hackle behind a uh, Lake Clear wobbler, which is just a uh, spoon that wobbles, and you put some line behind it with a hook on it and a worm, and it's the uh, classic Adirondack rig for brook trout. I don't want to take the head off. That's too... Okay. Sure. Huh? Sure. I'll make a better, uh, better shot. Better shot? Better shot for the movie tonight. Here's the big boy. Get a close up of him. Oh boy. That's a, that's a nice fish there. <laughs> Yeah, he's an honest 15, pound and a half maybe. We're going to grill him over the fire tonight in tin foil. A little uh, basil flavored olive oil perhaps. Along with some potatoes, onions, and uh, sugar snap peas. And a lot of bourbon. <laughs> Like Slim Jims? Sure. There's one up there for you. No oh, thanks. Oh, nice fish. We only got to two hits, but we were able to land both of them. Okay. Heading back to camp. We're going to be out of the wind. We're around the corner up here. That'll be good. What an enjoyable day. Tonight I get to try hammock. Hammock camping. I've never done that either. Nice hatch. And our campsite is right over there, out of the wind. Ah! Taters, taters, red onions, sugar snap peas with basil flavored olive oil. I'm assuming you've got some salt and pepper, right? Other than just in your beard. Oh well, what are you gonna do? We got some, a couple of Fritos. We already finished the Slim Jims. Uh, oh, and trout. <laughs> trout and some ham steaks. Cheese and crackers. Cheese and crackers. Kelly's uh, honestly 15 inch brook trout. And mine, honest 10 inch. Along with some red uh, potatoes and uh, red onions. Uh, sugar snap peas with garlic. Basted with. Uh, Basil and pea olive oil. Enjoying our bourbon, just sipping it. Had a ham steak later if we want it, and some sort of cake, something like that for dessert. So walnut maple maple cake. Walnut maple cake. So appetizers with uh, Ritz crackers there and stinky cheese. Happy, happy campers. It's only a uh, quarter to eight. We'll be in bed uh, just as soon as the liquor runs out there, which could be 15 minutes. <laughs> no way. No way. This is a nice cedar campfire, dry as could be, smokeless, 
which is rather nice. Dinner is done. We're having dessert. It's maybe uh, 9.30. Just about ready to hit the hay. It's been a good day. And we're not, we don't have to get up too early tomorrow because we're here. We don't have to drive. We just do a little paddle, a little hiking. So, good to be here. Indeed. Here we go. 7.30. Sunday morning. Camp is broken. We're going to fish our way out of here. See what we can do. Ah, a shot of Larry falling in the water now. That's my main reason of filming. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought you liked the straddle. Uh, I have a modified straddle here. <laughs> Mod own. Train the boots. Yep. Way home and a nice grizzle. Larry's trying for some something. <laughs> <laughs> 